Welcome back guys to Steven's DIY Auto Repair. Today, we're gonna to be taking a look at and reviewing the Quinn socket set. So let's get to it. Okay guys, so we're gonna go ahead and take a look at the Quinn socket set today. Uh, I recently did a video on the Milwaukee Packout socket set, um, but we're gonna look now at a little bit more budget friendlier socket set that's still at a decent quality for the price. So let's go ahead and look up and in, look inside here. Look at that, guys. So just to let you know, it does come with this, but I had already taken it out. So let's see if you guys can get a good look in there. Okay guys, so we're gonna go ahead and just kinda read off the little packaging that came with it here. Um, so you're gonna get your, um, it's uh, gonna be a 66 piece high vis socket set. It's gonna include three 72 quick release ratchets. They're supposed to be dural chrome vanadium steel sockets and ratchets, high visibility socket markings and color coded sockets for easy identification. It's gonna give you 26 quarter inch sockets, 28 three eighths sockets, and six half inch sockets. It's gonna give you a quarter, a three eighths, and a half inch extension bars, as well as um, the heavy duty carrying case. Um, they're gonna be six point and eight point sockets. So I'm not gonna go through um, all of this. You guys can go ahead and just pause the screen and take a look at exactly what size and stuff it comes with. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and check it out. So the case, pretty heavy duty, guys. Nice little, nice little hard plastic mold case. Not too bad. The latches are you know, plastic, but they're a little bit more on the heavier duty side. So now we have all of your sockets and ratchets, all of your sockets and ratchet ratchet wrenches jesus um let's see if i can get this one out of here close that sounds pretty nice here's your quick release in order to get the socket on and off your switch lever here Pretty good quality guys, not not bad quality. I'll show you guys how the, kind of how it works. So in order to snap on, let me close this because it's gonna end up falling. So in order to snap on the socket, you wanna press in and then you can't get it off unless you push in on this button here, releases the socket pretty easy. Pretty easy, guys. Okay, so what, one thing that's cool is um, it's got this, uh, they call it, uh, Quinn calls it their high-vis marking. I don't know if you guys can see this here. So it does say Quinn on it. Pretty nice etching. I'm assuming that's etched in. Jeez, almost dropped the sockets. So it, what's cool is they're also color coded. This is what they mean by color coded. So if you could see that red there, and then we could take another one here, and it's blue. So the blue is for metric, and the red is for SAE, for your standard. So when you're kind of looking in here, you're not looking all over the place. You go straight to the blue if you need a metric or you go straight to the red if you need a SAE. So aside from that, you have your standard sockets and then you also have a few uh, uh, deep well sockets here. Um, that's pretty cool. 
Uh, I like the fact that it gives you that. The only complaint that I have is if you notice, the only deep ones they give you is in SAE or standard. There's no deep well metric sockets, which is kind of a bummer. But other than that, um, it, this is pretty cool. They give you two different spark plug sockets. This one's gonna be uh, 13 sixteenths. Spark plug socket, it's got a little, uh, I think it's a, I don't know, that might be magnet inside there um, for your spark plugs. As well as here's another spark plug, five, five eighths, another spark plug socket. That's pretty cool. Okay guys, so this is a pretty cool set. Um, pretty pretty budget friendly as well. Um, this normally goes for $59.99 at Harbor Freight. Um, but if you have a 20% off coupon, you could probably pick it up a little cheaper. I actually picked this one up um, for $49.99. I got about $10 off for their instant savings um, promotion they were having. Um, couldn't really pass it up. I've used this exact set before um, prior to me purchasing this one. And the only thing I do have to say is on the set that I used, the 3H drive, the quick release um, got messed up. Um, as soon as I started using it, um, I wasn't torquing on anything crazy or nothing. As soon as I started using it, I noticed that the socket wasn't holding in and this was basically kind of like stuck in and I was having to hit this part on the ground to pop it out so that was a issue and it was a brand new socket uh, it was a brand new set that um, someone I know had purchased and I was actually test using it um, so but the cool thing is took it right back to Harbor Freight and they actually warranted out the whole set for him they uh, gave him a brand new set, no questions asked. He took in his old set and they gave him a completely brand new set. So I don't think it's anything to worry about. It might have just been, you know, one bad apple on the tree kind of thing. Um, it didn't stop me, obviously, from buying the set. I think it's a pretty cool set for the price point. Um, the only time I, I have seen this happen where the quick release doesn't work on another ratchet I actually have which is the 3 8 Pittsburgh Pro composite ratchet. Uh, this one I had warranted out myself as well. Um, similar to what had happened to this one, this one uh, was not working anymore. It wasn't, um, it wasn't stuck inside, but it, was hold, it wasn't holding the socket on there. It was just falling off. Okay guys, as I was saying, um, the quick release did not get stuck inside. It just, um, it was completely like this and it just wasn't holding the socket. The socket was just kept falling off. Um, so same thing, you know, this was prior to the incident um, the person uh, had with the Quinn socket set. This was prior to that. Um, so yeah, I took it in. Um, they just asked what was wrong with it. Said the quick release wasn't holding the socket. They said, no problem. Swapped it out for a new one. So you can't go wrong. With some of these more budget-friendly tools uh, these cheaper tools if you will um, so going back to the Quinn if you're not want willing to jump into the Milwaukee pack out socket set um, you can always jump into this uh, Quinn socket set um, pretty good value um, if you could catch it on sale for $49.99 that's even better um, and if this is still a little bit too too much for you or you're not ready for, for this set yet, um, they do have lower end sets that are going to be just the Pittsburgh brand. And those also have a lifetime warranty. This has a li limited limited lifetime warranty. Sorry, guys. So, and it, you know, they'll warranty these uh, parts out as well as uh, most of the Pittsburgh stuff as well. So, yeah, guys, I, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, in my opinion... It's a good set um, if you want to if you're just getting into needing a socket set for emergencies or um, you're doing your own DIY um, mo uh, automotive mechanics at home or <laughs> if you're a mobile mechanic this thing is uh, 
fits all needs. So not much more to say about it, guys. Pretty simple, pretty cool. All right, guys, so I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Uh, subscribe to my channel. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, go ahead and put them in the comment section below. If you would like to be notified when I put out a, another video, make sure to hit that notification bell. And if you would like to pick your, yourself up one of these Quinn socket sets, I'll put a link in the description below so you can start your own DIY projects. So until next time, have a good one.